Hello. The, the Magnum 94 here. I am playing Pokemon Emerald, and I'm going to record every single gym battle that I have. Now, this is not on an online emulator thing. So, look. Yeah. Um, uh, right now my team is a Trico and a Wizmer. I have others, but they're just fillers. So let's get started. Yeah. I'm only going to be showing the gym leaders. I'm not going to show the whole LP, just gym leaders. So, in fighting Roxanne, are you best to race your Pokemon up to around 14 ish, is what I like, at least, and have a good grass or water type. My grass starters put them at level 15. Yeah. So make sure you do not use pound or tackle or whatever your normal type move. Make sure you do not use that. And if you have Torchic, make sure you evolve it before you battle her. Yeah. In Sapphire, she only has one Geodude. But in Emerald GS2, I think. Pursuit, and that could be useful. How much it's pound dude? 40, 40, and I'll delete pound. That sounds good. Now, this will just be Trico, so yeah, I don't think. I think it'll be leveled up. Too much for him when he evolves to learn Fury Cutter, but I don't really care about that move. Now, just another boob to take out. Yeah. So those two are just just to be there, to be annoying. Hi. So the nose pass is the really annoying thing. It takes like four hits to kill it. Plus, she's not afraid to use a super version. I think she also has Orenberry on it, so. See, that did like less, like close to a fourth damage. If not even that much. Yeah, so. Even with a super effective move, it takes forever to kill it. Assuming that was maximum damage, because they did more, but... And no, the rock tomb to lower your speed. And it does a lot. So... It's best if you have a bunch of ordinary. Yeah. I, for one, forgot to stock up on... Um... Uh, super potions and whatnot. So, yeah, this might be a little bit difficult. Oh, she only uses potions. Well, that gave me two turns to use absorb and restore a bunch. Or, you know, some. Wait. Oh, right. Of course, I forgot about rock too lowering speed. Okay. So, hopefully I won't die. <laughs> um, another potion. Well, I guess each one does have two potions, two of their kind of restoring item. Yeah, so make sure you just pound it away hard <clears throat> with a really powerful water or grass type moves. Huh, speed die. That's weird. Block. I think that nose pass knows rock tomb tackle and block. It might a rock throw as well. Actually, I think it... No. Actually, I don't know what it does. And you've seen the three moves it used so far, so... And there goes Roxanne. Okay. Yeah, that noise pass is really annoying. Yeah. Just make sure if you start off with, with Torchic to evolve it before you battle. Because otherwise, your Torchic isn't going to get very far. 
I obtained the stone badge. Yeah, the stone badge. $1,500. Ooh, I get to watch my chick go to golf. He tries to learn Fury Cutter. No? Oh, yeah. Sound a little fixing. Oh, well, I wasn't going to teach it to him anyway. So, yeah. Rock Sand is relatively easy if you have something to counter every one of your Pokemon. And you get Rock Tomb as a team. Um. Yeah. So, that's it for Rock Sand. Rate, comment, subscribe, and bye.